I have my Google Chrome browser open. I have enabled the selector gadget extension and I have the home page of sourceforge.net open. What I want to do is scrape a list of project categories. Here are projects of the month, editor's choice, and featured, and also a list of the projects, which are Miranda IM and portableapps.com under projects of the month, BIRT iHub F type an EXO platform under Editor's Choice, and a set of additional projects under Featured. The traditional way to do it is to right-click on the page, say View Page Source, and I'm going to go Control-F and search on Projects of the Month. And I can see that this is a header 2 tag under a class POTM for Projects of the Month that's under a CSS tag of a CSS selector of card and titled. Figuring out the, the best combination of these is tricky and, and tends to be trial and error procedure. The selector gadget makes it a lot easier. So I'm going to enable selector gadget and now when I click on projects of the month it highlights in yellow everything that will be selected with the H2 tag. Notice that we also get the source forge over here, so I'm going to click on that, which will unselect it. And now we have dot title space H2, which is a CSS selector of title, followed by an HTML tag of H2. And this is what we'll use in our R code to scrape the web page. So I'm going to deselect this. I need to click on the selector gadget tag again. And I'll click on Miranda IM and notice that the download buttons are also highlighted and once I've unselected those I have dot project hyphen info a which also is a good tag. So I've gotten the information I need quickly using selector gadget for what looks like a promising CSS selector to build a list of project categories from and a second CSS selector to build a list of project names from. Next we'll turn our attention to the R code using Hadley Wickham's RVEST package to actually pull the data into a couple of lists. Now we'll use R and Hadley Wickham's RVEST package to scrape the data using the CSS selectors that Selector Gadget identified. The first thing we need to do is to install the library RVEST. This library is not yet on CRAN. It is in Hadley Wickham's GitHub repository. So you'll need to go to that repository and it's very important that you follow the installation instructions in the readme.md file there that shows how to pull something including installing the DevTools package and most likely needing to restart r and r Studio before you can successfully use the package. Then it's just a matter of giving it the URL and then for categories feeding the categories URL to three verbs from the RVS package HTML, HTML nodes, and HTML text. Note that we are using the CSS selector this dot titled h2 identified by selector gadget which is a combination of a CSS class titled and an HTML tag h2 and what gets returned is a character vector containing three strings. We repeat the process to get the projects and this time the CSS selector is dot project info a again identified by selector gadget and we get a character vector containing 13 strings. And so we basically are done pulling the data and we often need to do some additional cleanup and perhaps some additional filtering on it. I have included a little bit of regular expression code to show how you might go about starting this process.